welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am Ashley and this is my stitching corner. Today, as you can see, or as you might have seen from just the clip before I started here, um, we are getting a fair amount of snow today, so it is very snowy out. Um, on the mild side, it's not like really cold or anything, but it's a nice snowy day outside today. Um, so, and Larry's out with a friend of his for a few minutes, so I thought I would just pop on and film a quick video. I do not have a lot to show today, but that's because a lot's been going on. Um, I've been sick. I've had a cold or something <clears throat> for the past almost two weeks now, and I'm still getting over it. Um, <clears throat> and so for a while I wasn't feeling like stitching because I was sick. And now it's hard to stitch because I've done something to this side of my neck. I don't know if I slept funny on it. I don't know if um, I did something to it while I was working in the barn. But from like this part of my shoulder all the way up the side of my neck is like really sore. Um, and it's even kind of going into my shoulder a bit. So it's, it's yeah, it's been kind of fun to deal with for the last little while. Um... But yeah, as I mentioned, I am back in the barn again. I just started that last Monday. So I'm really excited and happy to be back working with the horse that I partially own. Um, he's great fun. He's such a goofball. Uh, he just makes me so happy. So I'm really glad to be back to doing that in the mornings. Um, I'm not back to my usual job at the other side of the stable yet, but that'll come um, we just have some yearlings in right now, so we're just kind of waiting for them to mature a little bit more before I go in and start handling them kind of thing. Um, but yeah, so it's just been kind of busy here, kind of chaotic, um, and I've just been doing a lot of self-care stuff that's outside of cross-stitch at the moment, so, um, but I have been stitching and... Yeah, I've just got, like I said, a, a, a short amount of time here to film for you guys today. I'm going to try to get this done before they come back. So, since my last video, I have gotten one finish, um, which is also, you know, I'm going to leave it in the plastic It's because it's kind of stuck in there. Um, it is a finish, and it's also an FFO. Now, I didn't... <clears throat> asking my community tab a week or two ago about um I have filmed a video of me fully finishing this project um so that now that you guys will have seen the project on my update video later this week I will edit and upload that finishing video for you to see but this is the hummingbird duo by dimensions um it's kind of like a learner's um thing and I just am not taking it out of the plastic because it's kind of in there really good and I just don't want to mess with it. Um, but that is the finished. Isn't that pretty? I love it. Um, this was fun to stitch. The back stitching was actually really fun too. Those um, lazy daisies were, were tricky. And I just backed it with some fabric like that. So yeah, that's, I'm happy to have something finished this year because I don't know if I've had it. I, outside of my little spring stitch that I did back in the spring, I don't think I've finished anything. So it's nice to have something else finished. Um, and on the, on the um, horizon of finishes, I do have another sort of finish. Um, I have been working a lot on my tiger family, my heaven and earth designs. Um, now the max color part of it has just been, I, I just, oh my gosh, it's been crazy, but I still love it. It's still good. It's just, it takes so, so much, so time consuming. Like it's just crazy. So this is the Max Color Tiger Family in the Jungle by Jan Patrick Krasny. Uh, and I'm stitching it on a 28 count Easy Count Lugana. 
and the last time I showed it, I told you guys I was really going to try to aim for a page finish. Wow. I did it. I finished the page. Oh my gosh. Look at that toucan. Doesn't he look great? He's not finished, obviously, but he looks so, so good. But that white on white in his chest area here, holy hell, a little bit of a nightmare, but we got it done. And now I've moved over and I am today working in this area over here in the bird. So I'm kind of picking a color and then just working it in wherever it will fit. And um, yeah, so I'm going to work here to finish this and then I'm going to do the same thing and start working in these park threads. And the goal is to finish this page by the end of the year. I don't know if that's going to be possible, but we will see. So we all know Christmas is kind of like a crazy time of the year, but yeah so i made this grime guard myself and i also made the needle minder myself so yeah max color tiger family in the jungle by Neil patrick krasny and heaven and earth designs <clears throat> so that's been interesting and the last project that i've been working on is a project that i have been trying to push myself to finish by christmas that's definitely not happening however I am working on it as much as I can and it's supposed to be the fact that I'm putting a lot of work in it is supposed to be Larry's Christmas present this year because he's been harassing me to finish and that is the silent flight by dimensions gold collection and I'm working on trying to finish the eagle right now and that's where I am on it now so I've been stitching the, the front wing here, just kind of picked one color and stitched it all in. And now I'm working on, there is the tip of this larger wing here where the sun's kind of gleaming off there. I've kind of started putting it up that way so that when I can, when I get up here, I can start at the tip of the wings and start stitching downward. Because I am a forever stitch from top to bottom type of stitcher. But when you start in the center, it's kind of hard to do that, right? To count yourself all the way up and then keep, anyway. <clears throat> but yeah, I'm happy with the progress I've made on it so far, even though it's like not a huge amount or anything. So for the remainder of this year, my goals are, like I said, to finish the second page of my Tiger Family in the Jungle by Jan Patrick Krasny, and then to also work as much as I can on this project here. So those are my focus pieces for the rest of 2023. And then as you guys know, in 2024, I'm going to be focusing a lot on um, a lot of other things. So. In the meantime, I might just post a video once a week to kind of give you guys an update on these two projects that I'm working on. Um, I, I don't like to stick to just two projects. However, they're the ones that are like super important to me to finish right now. So that's what we're doing. That's what we're sticking with. So yeah, sorry that is such a short video for you guys, but I did want to give you guys an update as to what has been going on in my life with me. Um, just a bit like with my health and stuff. And then um, to just give you guys a little bit of an update as to what I'm stitching. Because I am stitching. It's just, yeah, not on like 10 things at the same time. Okay, so I hope you guys uh, enjoy and I hope to see you again next week. Bye!